Greetings, inhabitants of San Somo. It is an honor to be here today in the shadow of the splendid metropolis of San Francisco. For the uninformed here, I'm Vladimir Lenin. I was born in April 1870 in Simbirsk, Russia, into honorary nobility. In 1886, my father died from a brain hemorrhage, and upon receiving the news of his death, the stereotypical Russian childhood I had been raised in was over, for better or worse. Around the same time, my elder brother, Alexander, had been studying the illegal teachings of Karl Marx and Dmitri Pissarov. Alex became intertwined in a plot, conspiring to kill Tsar Alexander III, and the plot was exposed, and Alexander, my brother, suffered a death by hanging. I was utterly devastated, and any joy contained in my heart was then obliterated. I swore to have retribution on the government that had taken my brother's life. While attending Kazan University, I decided to follow my brother's revolutionary footsteps, religiously studying the teachings of Karl Marx and other communist philosophers. I was expelled for, expelled for inciting a riot, but fortunately, I was able to obtain a law degree while attending St. Petersburg University, and shortly thereafter, I was exiled to Siberia for possession of communist paraphernalia. I then traveled around Europe nomadically for 15 years, and I attained a positive reputation amongst my fellow <coughs> revolutionaries for publishing the Iskra, a uh, communist news publication. That led me to becoming the leader of the Bolsheviks, a sect of the Russian Social Democratic Workers' Party. All these struggles and triumphs have transformed me into the man I am today, the savior of Russia. Russia may be over 5,000 miles away, your assistance is needed. My country and its citizens are absolutely absolutely fed up with the despicable treatment of us by Tsar Alexander and his administration. <laughs> and a revolt is forthcoming. My goal is to establish a socialist government that provides equal income for all and represents all people, especially the working class, accordingly. And I also intend to convert all factories and such to state institutions. Additionally, on a more controversial <laughs> note, I aim to legalize homosexuality and support abortion. I have legions of Russians that support my cause and ideology, but the final, the final fate of Russia rests upon the participation of others, like you Americans. We need you to stand up against tyranny, just like you did against the British, and crush any opposition that stands in the face of equality.